guys, it's me, X Phoenix Wing here. Respawn point set. You can and only sleep at night. And I am gonna have to do some explaining because there's everything's gonna be different when I step out of the village. Uh so Respawn point set. You can only sleep at night. Um, I have a total of nine deaths, nine on screen, nine off screen. This is pretty much all I was able to get from the nether, because I tried to go and get the rest of the stuff from that little fortress, and I had lost a lot of materials. Um, I did get these armor trims, I was able to get some of these swords, but for the most part, I am almost completely out of resources. And the only reason I have these is because my buddy had joined my world right after I had stopped recording, and I hadn't talked to him in a while, so I took the time to kind of talk to him. He went out exploring as I started farming and getting stuff ready he did say there was another chest somewhere too a stuff one thing he was able to do was find me more diamonds I didn't want to record it because I didn't know I didn't I just want to be like hey I'm recording. But I was able to get more wood. I do have some of those. I'm not sure what you can do with them. You could give me this stuff. Potions, cakes. I got coal. I did give him the sword when he joined the world. That's where that one came from. He did make this because I didn't know what this was. Respawn point set. You can only sleep at night. I think that's gonna take durability off that. I'm gonna take that off. I pretty much have nothing right now. Because of what happened. say I, I think I made a grave mistake going to the nether without being properly prepared for it because the nether is not how I remembered it in any way sure really this is like, are these guys mad at me? but I did find an underwater cave down there which I didn't know that's what that was before chest but I did kind of 
expand my farm a little bit at least. I'm not sure. I don't think you meant to make all those crafting tables. He had a lot. He had bone meal. Take what I can. I'll take that pick. Food. Well, I guess I'll just leave that chest there for now. Cause he did go exploring for a while, and we kind of got to talking and stuff. And what was going on in our lives? was another reason I didn't record, it was a bunch of personal stuff. And I wasn't really about to be doing that. Respawn point says you can somewhere. only sleep at night. But I'm probably... I probably am gonna... It's another name tag. Sweet. I wish I had a saddle. It's the only thing I wish I had. I think it's getting darker. Respawn there we go. But I'm probably just gonna do a time lapse. I am gonna get rid of the coordinates. Actually, I'm just gonna keep the coordinates the way they are. I do have more building blocks because of them too. I thought there was an extra shield I didn't know about. Right, that was it. Um, where's... That in there. 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 Pretty much, I'm just gonna terraform this. Cause I was thinking about where to put my house, and I kind of figured this area right here was gonna be good, but I'm not sure how to do it yet. But I am gonna terraform this little area over here. Ouch. I'm going to terraform this area real quick and make a harbor, so I'll be right back guys. Hopefully I can cut it down so you guys can keep watching. And that's all I'm really going to do right now. I'm just pretty much be terraforming a lot. He did have bone meal. Oh, yeah, I did expand my carrot farm some. Might get rid of the potatoes. I don't think I need the potatoes. Yeah, I might get rid of the potatoes. Or at least I get this one little space. That was the wheat. Because I did realize how much I would go through.
Yeah, I pretty much was super under prepared for the nether. So it's not how anything like I remember. So I was kind of just caught off guard in a way. Which, I mean, it's fine, but I uh, kind of wish it didn't happen, because all my levels went bye-bye. Which is something I knew was going to happen sometime. You know, I was hoping to maybe keep my deaths down to at least one. Because if I do a hardcore world, I won't get a chance to do that, and that's what kind of gets to me in a way, because I was going to try to treat it like a hardcore world, but to kind of test myself to see if I could have been ready for it, and the answer is to that, no, I was nowhere near ready like I probably should have been, I did underestimate it. Because it had been super long and I was like, man, it'll probably be easy. It is not easy. But I guess I just started a little time lapse. And let all this continue growing. And then I'll come talk to you guys in a little bit. I do hope you guys will like everything and, and keep watching. It's just going to be a, a long run in this series. Hello guys, it's Future Me here talking, and all the recordings that you'll probably see uploaded after this were all in one sitting, and it's going to be a couple time lapse, and I forgot to make an outro when I made this too, because I did not set a timer for myself, and also the rain did not stop, but I ended up fixing it, I don't know if it was supposed to keep raining or not, but all I did was log in and out to see if it'll quit the raining and it did so that's good but I have noticed gained some subscribers which is pretty pretty exciting guys you know keep it up I hope to see more eventually and uh, I did accidentally while I'm here talk about I did upload the wrong video twice well not really the wrong video I uploaded the same video twice which YouTube shouldn't allow that I figured I would get a notification or they wouldn't have let it go up and I got messed up in all my recordings about what was what <laughs> but hope it should all be fixed now the next episode 25 is the real episode 25 that's gonna go up and this is gonna be episode 26 and it shouldn't I should have a couple episodes ready to go throughout the, today and tomorrow and what I'm going to start doing is recording them not really in a day advance because then I feel like I'm cheating you guys but to make up for some time that I've lost and to keep the series more interesting and going and keep it thriving I am going to start probably trying to upload more parts 
if in a day. I think the max will probably be three if I can. It's just really hard whenever I work and I have to come home and do other stuff and it takes my focus away and I've been kind of busy with a lot of different stuff. I also didn't realize that I hit that fox. I'm sorry. But as it goes, it will be a lot of different time lapses, but the outcome I think is definitely worth worth it in some of the areas that I do. And my base is actually going to come up. I haven't moved anything into the base. I might do that off camera just so you guys don't have to sit there and watch me reorganize my chest, my inventory. But I did come across an item from a, a traveling villager, which I had recently researched, and there is a biome that it naturally spawns in, but I didn't think I'd get the chance to actually, because I think that was part of the update recently where you could get said item through a wandering trader. And a heads up, I didn't calculate my house, so it's a little uneven by two lots, and I didn't realize that until after I had made the roof on it. So, please don't judge me when you see me building this house. I did not calculate it. I didn't know how big I was going to make it, I was just kind of eyeballing everything, but I feel like it came out alright. It's definitely not as tall as the villager one. I'm not quite done with it. I was going to build an underground area for the library. I was going to move the nether, netherite, not netherite, but the nether wart. But it seems to be growing on the top very well, so I don't see a point in moving it. I might just keep it in front of the farmhouse. But I am going to dig into the mountain a little bit. I haven't done that yet. This is just future ideas of pitching. What I might do. I probably will do. I might make... Where the... Okay, so if you look under the village, I may make a mob farm down there under the animals, just because of the fact that I didn't realize it was a cliff. And I think a mob farm would probably be helpful, especially getting me XP. I'm not trying to make any super duper crazy mob farm, but I would like to make one right there under it, because it's already, the top's already covered. I'll just need to cover the rest around it. Which I think would be pretty interesting because I have not made a mob farm in a while. And <laughs> I do kind of need the levels, especially where I have diamonds and I want to enchant, considering I lost all my levels nine times. And I lost the majority of the loot. I don't know if I said this in any of my videos. I went really far in and completely raided one of those abandoned fortresses things. After I died when that one charged at me. And on my way back, I was able to take half the loot. And on my second time to try to get back, I was blown up again by a bunch of gas. Hello guys, it's me, X Phoenix Wing, and uh definitely didn't make an outro so I'm gonna work on that real quick I know I skipped because I didn't have enough footage to keep talking <laughs> which is kind of funny because I usually don't talk over that whole recording but yeah if it wasn't for the gas I definitely would have made it out of the nether with a bunch of more loot I had blocks of bone meal, I had like 19 or 20 blocks of bone meal, a full inventory of armor, 
my gold armor that I had, a bunch of more swords, some shields, and my armor that I got back from the piglins. And it all went south the moment I had reached my portal. But I will end it here, guys, and I'll let you guys see what happens in the next episode. Thanks for it, sir, watching and subscribing. You know, I, I will read any comments that are posted because I'm not a huge channel yet, and you know, I'd like to see any feedback or all feedback really and you guys are awesome just keep doing what you're doing and I'll keep making videos